Hello everyone! Welcome to Teacher Frail TV! Our subject for today is Math 4, Quarter 2, Week 7 Milk Base Let's learn about Giving the place value and value and reading and writing decimal numbers through hundreds Hello kids! Today, we are going to learn about giving the place value and value and reading and writing decimal numbers through hundreds. In your previous grade, you learned how to find the place value and value of a number using the place value chart. This time, the place value chart of whole number can be extended to help you to read and write decimal numbers. In this lesson, you are expected to Give the place value and value of a digit of a given decimal number through hundreds as well as to read and write decimal numbers through hundreds. Look at the place value chart of a whole number with decimal number below and try to analyze the place value and value of the digit in the decimal number. Example 1 1 is in the 1's place and the value is 1. 2 is in the 10's place and the value is 2 tenths or can be written as 0 0.2. 3 is in the 100's place and the value is 3 hundreds or can be written as 0 0.03. The decimal word is 1 and 23 hundreds. Let's study example 2. 0 is in the 1's place. This means that there is no whole number. 4 is in the 10's place and the value is 4 tenths. They can be both written as 0 0.4 or 0.4 or 4 tenths. Let's study example 3. 2 is in the 1's place and the value is 2. 0 is in the tens place and the value is 0. 7 is in the hundreds place and the value is 7 hundreds or can be written as 0 0.07 or 7 hundreds. This means 0 tenth and 7 hundreds. The decimal word is 2 and 7 hundreds. To read the decimal number, Read the digits after the decimal point. Then read the place value after the last digit. The last digit is in the hundreds place. If there are digits starting from 1 and up in whole number part, read the decimal point as end. And read the number starting from the highest whole number followed by the decimal numbers. 23 hundreds. It is... 1 and 23 hundreds. Another example. 2.45. This can be read and write as 2 and 45 hundreds. 0 is placed to any empty column between the decimal point and the digits. 0 0.86 or 0 0.86. These are both correct. This can be read and write as 86 hundreds. Now, try to do the following activities. Learning Task 1 Give the place value of the underlined digit. Number 1 The underlined digit is 5. What is the place value of this digit? Very good! The place value of this digit is hundreds. Number 2 The underlined digit is 1. What is the place value of this digit? Very good! The answer is... Tens! Number 3. The underlined digit is 0. What is the place value of this digit? Very good! The place value is... Tens! 
Number 4. The underlined digit is 9. What is the place value of this digit? Very good! The place value is tens. Number 5. The underlined digit is 8. What is the place value of this digit? Very good! The place value is hundreds. Number 6. The underlined digit is 7. What is the place value of this digit? Very good! The place value is tens. Number 7. The underlined digit is 2. What is the place value of this digit? Very good! The place value is hundreds. Number 8. The underlined digit is 4. What is the place value of this digit? Very good! The place value is hundreds. Number 9. The underlined digit is 2. What is the place value of this digit? Very good! The place value is tens. Number 10. The underlined digit is 8. What is the place value of this digit? Very good! The place value is tens. Number 11. The underlined digit is 1. What is the place value of this digit? Very good! The place value is tens. Number 12. The underlined digit is 8. What is the place value of this digit? Very good! The place value is tens. Number 13. The underlined digit is 5. What is the place value of this digit? Very good! The place value is hundreds. Number 14. The underlined digit is 0. What is the place value of this digit? Very good! The place value is tens. And number 15. The underlined digit is 6. What is the place value of this digit? Very good! The place value is hundreds. And now, let's move to learning task 2. Give the value of the underlined digit. Number 1. What is the value of this underlined digit? Very good! 8 tenths. Number 2. What is the value of this underlined digit? Very good! 2 tenths. Number 3. What is the value of this underlined digit? Very good! Six hundreds. Number four. What is the value of this underlined digit? Very good! Nine tenths. Number five. What is the value of this underlined digit? Very good! Five hundreds. Number six. What is the value of this underlined digit? Very good! One hundreds. Number seven. What is the value of this underlined digit? Very good. Zero. Number eight. What is the value of this underlined digit? Very good. Three tens. Number nine. What is the value of this underlined digit? Very good. Eight tens. Number 10. What is the value of this underlined digit? Very good. 7 tenths. Number 11. What is the value of this underlined digit? Very good. 6 tenths. Number 12. What is the value of this underlined digit? Very good. 9 hundreds. Number 13. What is the value of this underlined digit? Very good. Eight hundreds. Number 14. What is the value of this underlined digit? Very good. Two tens. And number 15. What is the value of this underlined digit? Very good. 
Six tens. Next activity, learning task three. Write the numbers in the blank. Number one, eight in the hundreds place, three in the tens place. What is the correct answer? Very good. The correct answer is 38 hundreds. Number two, nine in the ones place, zero in the tens place. Six in the hundreds place. What is the correct answer? Very good. The answer is nine and six hundreds. Number three, five in the hundreds place, zero in the tens place. What is the correct answer? Very good. The answer is five hundreds. Number four. 1 in the tens place, 7 in the hundreds place, 0 in the tens place, 9 in the hundreds place. What is the correct answer? Very good! The correct answer is 710 and 9 hundreds. Number 5. 9 in the tens place, 7 in the tens place, 6 in the ones place, 3 in the hundreds place. What is the correct answer? Very good! The correct answer is 96 and 73 hundreds. Learning Task 4 Write the following in decimal form. Number 1, 2 and 3 hundreds. Write this in decimal form. Very good! The answer is 2 and 3 hundreds. Number 2, 65 and 65 hundreds. Write this in decimal form. Very good. The answer is 65 and 65 hundreds. Number 3, 59 hundreds. Write this in decimal form. Very good. The answer is 59 hundreds. Number 4, 7 tens. Write this in decimal form. Very good. The answer is 7 tens. Number 5. 84 hundreds. Write this in decimal form. Very good. The answer is 84 hundreds. Number 6. 49 and 4 tens. Write this in decimal form. Very good. The answer is 49 and 4 tenths. Number 7, 5 and 2 hundreds. Write this in decimal form. Very good. The answer is 5 and 2 hundreds. Number 8, 10 and 15 hundreds. Write this in decimal form. Very good. The answer is 10 and 15 hundreds. Number 9, 2 hundreds. Write this in decimal form. Very good. The answer is 2 hundreds. Number 10, 19 hundreds. Write this in decimal form. Very good. The answer is 19 hundreds. Learning Task 5. Match each phrase found in column A with the correct decimal form in column B. 4 and 9 tenths. The correct answer is letter D. Number 2, 49 hundreds. The correct answer is letter E. Number 3, 59 and 40 hundreds. The correct answer is letter F. Number 4, 7 tenths. The correct answer is letter J. Number 5, 86 hundreds. The correct answer is letter I. Number 6, 4 tenths. The correct answer is letter H. Number 7, 3 hundreds. The correct answer is letter G. 
Number 8. Fifteen hundreds. The correct answer is letter C. Number 9. Two hundreds. The correct answer is letter A. And number 10. Nineteen hundreds. The correct answer is letter B. And for our last activity, learning task 6, choose the letter of the correct answer. Number 1. In 213 and 49 hundreds, the digit blank is in the hundreds place. Letter A, 2. Letter B, 1. Letter C, 3. Or letter D, 9. What is the correct answer? Very good! The correct answer is letter D. The digit 9 is in the hundreds place. Number 2. In 43 and 9 hundreds, the digit blank is in the 10th place. Letter A, 4. Letter B, 3. Letter C, 0. Or letter D, 9. What is the correct answer? Very good! The correct answer is letter C. The digit 0 is in the 10th place. Number 3. In 23 and 45 hundreds, the digit 5 has a value of blank. A, 5. B, 50. C, 5 tenths. Or D, 5 hundreds. What is the correct answer? Very good! The correct answer is letter D, 5 hundreds. Number 4. What is the value of 6 in 5 and 46 hundreds? A. 6 tenths B. 6 hundreds C. 6 thousands Or D. 6 What is the correct answer? Very good! The correct answer is letter B. 6 hundreds Number 5. 2 and 5 hundreds written in decimal symbol as A. 2 and 50 B. 250 C. 2 and 5 thousands Or D. 2 and 5 hundreds What is the correct answer? Very good! The correct answer is Letter D. 2 and 5 hundreds Number 6 9 in the tens place and 5 in the hundreds place is same as A. 95 hundreds B. 59 hundreds C. 95 thousands Or D. 905 thousands What is the correct answer? Very good! The correct answer is Letter A. 95 hundreds Number 7 is 0 0.63 and 0 0.63 the same? A. Yes B. Maybe C. No D. Sometimes What is the correct answer? Very good! The correct answer is Letter A. Yes And number 8 3 and 55 hundreds is written in decimal symbol as A. 3.55 B. 0 0.355 C. 3.055 D. 35 What is the correct answer? Very good! The correct answer is Letter A. 3 and 55 hundreds Kids, are your all answers correct? Wow! Good job! Kids, I hope you learned a lot from this lesson. Until our next topic, bye-bye kids! Thanks for watching!